As coastal communities face ecological collapse and ruin, it's still reassuring to know you can get in your 18 holes. Back aboard the Cajun Queen, family tensions are at an all-time high. Kyle, what's wrong? Can you catch no reason? I can, but this one's like 20 feet. 15. Whatever. Can't do it. I'll come out there, I'll do it. The old man with one hand. Yeah, well, maybe you shouldn't be mutilating baby sharks. What you say? Nothing. Boy couldn't catch in a diaper. He telling me how to honor Shaw. Believe that? I mean, I came down here thinking it'd be a good opportunity for some father-son bonding. But now, I don't know. I might start looking for another summer job. Hey, not everybody made to be a fisherman. I just hope this whole university thing works out for him, yeah? Despite the catfish's highly developed auditory system, lab tests reveal they still prefer CDs over vinyl. This instantized protein makes a great between-meal supplement, giving the shark the energy she needs to eat on serious pants. can tell what may be found in a shark's stomach, it's truly the ocean's garbage can.
Tigeroos are part of a complete balanced breakfast for anyone aspiring to one day suffer from fatty liver disease. Sapphire Bay's famous Pier 1 provides visitors with plenty of ski ball, popcorn shrimp, and elegantly airbrushed t-shirts. discover the miracle of self-love. Haven for small government ideologues, Port Clovis prides itself in its lax amusement park safety standards.
Anyone who has delved into the stomach contents of a shark is acutely aware that they'll eat just about anything. insurance investigators questioning their disability claims. That out to the economy when he wasn't nothing but an itty bitty boy. The fact that he was afraid of that Ferris wheel should have told me he wasn't never gonna be no shark hunter. another day. in a figure eight pattern, prior to an attack.
is well known, volleyballs make way better friends than soccer balls, who will stab you in the back the first chance they get. America's largest shark finning enterprise, Mama Maybelle Bryant has collected quite a fleet of recreational boats. Her fail sons, Randall and Tyson, can often be spotted piloting them around Sapphire Bay. Parrotfish here have kept Sapphire Bay's local hammerhead healthy and strange looking. The sight of this shark is nearly insatiable.
An insatiable fish, the bull shark is nine-tenths appetite. Most American cities, the founders of Port Clovis were Freemasons, and probably Illuminati. They congregated in secret UFO bases to perform Luciferian blood. <laughs> Parrotfish's mouths feature a pharyngeal mill, specialized teeth located in its throat. Believe it or not, people paid over $12,000 to sleep in these tents and listen to Swedish DJs for an entire weekend. Parrotfish congregate in pairs, wherein a single dominant male lives with several females and perpetuates the hegemony. It's here in the grotto that the shark can discover the absolute serenity deep within her soul.
evolutionary anomaly, the hammerhead. revered as a protector of humans. clearly superior depth perception. No such thing as a recession-proof business, except for the frozen banana stand. Whether boom or bust, the demand for reliable, quality frozen bananas remains a constant.
trade in boat ownership manifests itself in a variety of ways here in Port Clovis. Gobbling up anything that finds its way into the water. Goaded by lusty appetites, the shark's sole aim is to eat and evolve. Even for sharks, it's important to create personal time for sober self-reflection. Water bringing their explosives and poor impulse control. It's burning. It's burning. It's always best for sharks to stay wet and oxygenated. shark's life, it will ingest quite a broad assortment of flotsam and jetsam. Well, I'm sure 
the shark's dead. It's another unsuccessful shark hunt for the people of Port Clovis. Sailors of yore believed that the mere sighting of a shark portended the death of a crewman. As twilight falls, Pete is in an uncharacteristically quiet mood. It's a dangerous job. It's not something unknown to me. What you want to see dangerous? Look at that, yeah? That's PT 522. My daddy crewed that off of Guadalcanal. It was Navy. Gunner's mate. Pacific Theater. But when I was 16 men, came back a day later with three. Man survives all that. Just to die here in the Gulf. What happened to him? Oh, you don't like me saying this. But my daddy, his granddaddy, was killed by a mega shark. I, I, I'm sorry. He's talking about a prehistoric fish that went extinct 2.6 million years ago. I seen it. Now, you were a kid. Ain't they discover new animals all the time? Sort of. Well, not, not exactly. In lots of cases, they're just corrections of species with different names. Also stuff like misspelling. But, I just say, maybe there are things in the water that ain't in your textbook. Stick around. Maybe you learn a thing or two this summer. Whatever. The ocean is vast. The majority of it still remains unmapped and unexplored by mankind. Perhaps Kyle shouldn't be so quick to dismiss his father's fevered ramblings. <laughs> 